Hello and welcome back to our YouTube channel Oracle DBA Online Training. This is going to be an announcement for upcoming uh, batch. If you are a regular follower of our YouTube channel, you might have already received the notification for a new batch that is going to start in the month of May. Still, if you haven't uh, got that message, I will. I would like to share this information with you guys. Uh, our new batch will be starting from the month of um, May and that the date is 11th of May. This is going to be a complete weekend batch so that you can attend these batches uh, by managing your regular work. So coming back to the batch, uh, what are the things that we have covering in this syllabus? Uh, I will be providing the details here. Uh, if you have already seen our website, you can visit under the blogs there. You can get complete information. If you are, if you haven't seen that, I will provide you the links in the description. You can go through the uh, more detail about it. So this batch will be starting from 11th of May, and uh, you can join this batch. Just have to you know join our WhatsApp chat uh, group group chat. There you can get a more and more information related to this course. Also, you can write an email to us on the following email address. From there, we will help you uh, with the further details. You can check the syllabus course syllabus under this one. Let me uh, open this link for you guys. So this is our course for this <clears throat> entire program. So overall, this course will be for four months duration. There are more than 55 sessions are there, which will cover mostly uh, up to 70 hours. So each session will be around 60 to 90 sessions. And you can expect like each, uh, each of the sessions will be having like, <clears throat> so per week we will, try to have two sessions and if possible, we'll try for a third session also in between. So mostly uh, we'll be covering a two session and then each of the sessions will be of 60 to 90 minutes each. And this entire program will run for four months. There are different, different modules that we will be covering. The first module will be an introduction to the Linux. The second module is will be Oracle database architecture. Again, you will be learning everything from the scratch. So suppose you are not uh, familiar with Oracle database. This course is designed for you. You can learn everything from the scratch covering all aspect of the Oracle database administration. So as soon as you learn about that architecture uh, discussion, then you'll be going through the installation. In the installation, you will be learning the silent installation and you will be also learning the, uh, the graphical interface for performing the software installation. Later, we'll be creating the database, which includes the pluggable database, container database, which is a mandatory for 21C onwards. All the database should have the uh, this particular feature. And along with this, you'll be learning like how you can manage the database. So there are different, different models that have been designed and you'll be learning about the table space, user management, role management privileges. Along with this, you'll be also learning the control file management, review log file management, archive logs. So our regular database administrator should know what are the steps uh, related to our regular activities that has been covered in this. So after this, we'll be also covering the backup and recovery, which includes uh, ARM and restoration and recovery. And then also you'll be learning about the export import data pump utility. So this entire uh, module will be covering almost eight sessions. Here you'll be learning each and every commands that is required for regular activity. You'll be learning how to perform the database restoration, performing the recovery operations for various uh, scenarios like the recovery of lost SP file, control files, data files, and so on. So apart from this, you will be also learning how to perform the, how to schedule the backup jobs for regular activities. Apart from this, you'll be learning about the data guard administration. So this data guard administration, basically there are, there are almost six to say seven sessions that will be getting covered. You'll be learning how to, uh, the architecture of the data guard. Also, you'll be learning how to create the standby database from the scratch. So we'll be having two different servers that we will be configuring the primary and standby database. We'll later we'll be performing the switch over switch back activity failover we will be configuring the data guard broker using the DGMGRL utility snapshot standby failover activities. So various topics related to the data guard has been covered in, in this particular module. Apart from this, module number 10 will be covering the patching activity, which is like a very important topic for any database administrator. 
and then after this we'll be going ahead with data database upgradation so along with database patching you will be also doing the database upgradation that will be a dedicated three session where you will be learning about the different types of database upgradation apart from this in the module number 12 we are going to learn about the real application clustering again this this particular topic has been dedicatedly given six sessions there we'll be learning about the rack architecture important prerequisites for rack configuration two node rack configuration we'll be learning about the regular activities uh, such as uh, asm management rack database management checking the various logs managing the instances and the database also you'll be learning about how to add the delete the nodes in the rack database patching of rack database very important topics that you'll be uh, learning here apart from this if time permits, we'll try to configure Rack standby database also. But anyways, we are going to provide all the documentation so you can follow along the same. Apart from this, the module number 13 will be covering the performance tuning uh, section of the database. There you will be learning about our regular uh, performance related the query uh, identification. Like let's say there is a slowness issue in the database, how you can identify that, what are the improvement area you can you know, cover up for any database how to read the AWR report, ASS report, then we have a DDM report. So all those things will be covered up. How you can fetch the query plan, how to build the, uh, how to gather the stats for the tables or um, rebuilding the indexes. So those things will be covered under the performance tuning. After this, uh, the next module will be Oracle data, uh, Oracle Golden Gate. Again, here we are giving you the, at least the, um, heads up on the Golden Gate technology that you'll be learning about the, basic concept, architecture, what are the important components for a Golden Gate, how to configure the software for Golden Gate, how to configure the unidirectional or bidirectional application. So those aspects will be covered in the module number 14. Again, this is not a very advanced level of Golden Gate, but yes, you will be getting familiar with Golden Gate. So if anyone says like, do you know Golden Gate? You can say, yes, I know. I have done this kind of configuration. So you'll it, it will definitely going to boost your profile as well as you will be having a good confidence on the this particular subject. The last module that is going to be Oracle Enterprise Manager, there you'll be learning about the Oracle Enterprise Manager configuration from the scratch. First, you'll be learning about the basic uh, concepts and then you'll be going through the configuration part. And later we'll be learning how to add the new host in the OEM monitoring, exploring the database uh, dashboard for the OEM, monitoring the database from the OEM utility, scheduling the jobs via the OEM. So email notification also is one of the important points that we need to learn. And at the end, database administrator administration via the OEM. So these are the some of the important points that you'll be learning under the Oracle Enterprise Manager, that is the OEM tool. And the last and most important point, what are the benefits that you are going to get from this entire syllabus uh, after entire this entire training? So at the end, you'll be given interview questions. For each session, you'll be given a recorded uh, materials for the future reference. A regular assignment will be given for each module. So let's say we are covering the Golden Gate module. So I'll be giving you the assignments that you have to complete within, let's say, two weeks, three weeks on the basis of that. So each of the sorry, each of the modules will have a dedicated assignments so that you will be also learning uh, in this particular process. And for the dedicated guidance purpose, we have created a WhatsApp groups. There you can ask any question, any times related to the subject. And then after this, we can approve, you'll also getting the documentation for each of the session. So today, let's say I'm covering the inter Oracle Enterprise Manager. So in order to configure or in order to uh, manage that Oracle Enterprise Manager, what are the documentation needed? The steps-by-step -step guidelines will be given in that documents. Along with this, you'll be also getting the software patches that we, again will be for a learning purpose only. And then at the end, once you complete this course, you'll be getting a certificate. So this is how this entire program has been designed. The start date for this new batch will be from the month of May, May month. Basically the start date will be 11th of May. So please do uh, start giving, I mean, uh, registering for this particular batch if you're interested. Uh, join our dedicated WhatsApp group there. You can join this batch and you can be a part of this batch. So, uh, so before start of uh, this particular batch, 11th of May, you have to pay the first registration fees around like 
9th or 10th of May. And then from the 11th May onwards, we will be starting this batch. Again, this is going to be a dedicated weekend batch, so you don't have to worry about the. Mostly it will be either in the morning or evening India standard times. So if you are from the US location or any other subcontinents, you can basically look uh, the India and US time accordingly. Okay, so if if suppose you are in the if you are in the US location, so your morning time will be the India's evening time, and vice versa. So please, you can always visit this particular uh, blog where you can get more and more information. The syllabus copy is available here. You can go through the syllabus. You can join this WhatsApp group. As soon as you join the WhatsApp group, you can ask more and more questions related to this batch. So once again, thanks for watching this video. This is just an introduction to the new batch that we are going to start in the month of May. If you are new to our YouTube channel, please do subscribe this channel. You are already getting a lot of learning materials. And uh, one more request I will make. If you, if you enroll the membership, you can access the exclusive contents which are related to our batch. So please go through this and uh, if you have any question, you can always reach out to me on and the given contact details and email ID. Thank you and have a good one.